Welcome to 3 Minute Thoughts. So recently I saw a movie called Don't Look Up. The basic premise is asteroids coming to Earth and you get to see how people react before the world gets destroyed. It's a parody along the lines of Dr. Strangelove and it was okay, but I'm not gonna talk about that. I was actually curious how realistic of depiction is something like that. Oddly, at the same time that it came out, there was a series of shows I was watching called Hermitcraft, which is a bunch of YouTubers playing Minecraft, shooting all the same server and shooting their perspectives of the server. And it goes, it started in July and it ended in December with the moon crashing into the server. And it was interesting watching people's reactions or the, to, to the event. So about October is when the people who were on the server started noticing that the moon was getting bigger. And you see some people would then start creating measuring devices to try to measure how big it was getting. There are lots of theories of what was going on. Two different cults started up in the server. Uh, one that actually tried like sacrificing other players. There was a player with the name Moon in their name and they're being blamed for this event. What else is happening? Someone else, another player, his base was shaped like a moon. They also were getting blamed. Two people tried to destroy the moon unsuccessfully. And it ended with, like, a bunch of people did escape. Some people stayed behind. They made bunkers. They just, it was interesting watching people's reactions because they were all trying to do their own thing. And then all of a sudden, there was this catastrophe. A few people worked together. Like, at most, like, five, a group of five worked together. Basically, one of them built a rocket ship and charged everyone else to so capitalism in play to charge them to use the rocket ship to escape and also charge other people to help get their valuables off the planet which again this is all role play it doesn't actually matter we know they all survive for the next season anyway and they don't bring anything with them but it was interesting watching various people's reactions how they were treating each other and just what they were doing i don't think there was anything that happened that was similar to like there was actually one person in denial uh again the one whose base was shaped like a moon he would always sleep whenever it turned nighttime so he never saw the moon until like the very last day people were like hey do you know the moon's gonna crash into the planet and he's like what and he finally looked up and saw the moon there huge in the sky and he's like when did that start and this is on his last episode he's mentioning this it was interesting watching the takeaway of all the various people's perspectives in how to handle this event. Some people, they finished their projects they wanted to do. Some people did not finish their projects. It was an interesting microcosm. I'd like to see like more examples of something like that where you have people playing a game and then you do throw the twist in like that just to see how they work together or not work together. Anyway, those are my thoughts and uh, have a good one.